What would you do if your home got destroyed during a hurricane? In this video, we bring to you a whimsical shipping container house in St. Augustine, Florida, belonging to a local artist whose home was destroyed by Hurricane Irma in 2017. Welcome back. This three-story whimsical shipping container home belongs to a local artist who lost his home to Hurricane Arma in 2017. The structure of the home is made up of nine 40-foot high cube shipping containers. Two containers form a workshop rooms on the ground floor. Another two containers are used as purely decorative elements and Five containers provide approximately 1,600 square feet of living space. One container on the structure has been tilted diagonally as an architectural feature with a staircase leading up to it, forming an entryway into the main living areas on the second and third floor levels. The living spaces begin on the second level with a covered porch, an open plan living space, two bedrooms, and a common bathroom. The entire third level is a master suite with a master bedroom, a bathroom, and a studio space. The second and third levels are joined by a staircase inside a 40 foot long and 8 foot high double volume space made by flipping one of the containers on the top of another that acts as a gallery and also provides access to the roof deck. The single flight staircase leads to the first floor level of the building. The staircase is quite a piece of design and you can't fail to notice it from the reception area of the building. The staircase connects to the big covered front porch. The front entrance opens into a mid-sized contemporary open concept living space with white walls, comfortable chairs, custom tabletops, pieces of artwork on the wall, and a flat screen TV for your entertainment. The double height void in the living room creates a high and impressive space in the house, which allows for cross ventilation through the stack effect. Next to the living area is an intimate breakfast nook, nicely furnished with banquet seating arrangement. The breakfast nook is a complete replica of the dining that was destroyed in the previous home. A fully furnished open kitchen has steel countertops, overhead and under the counter storage cabinets with stainless steel appliances, which ensures the slick kitchen remains fully functional for family daily activities. The kitchen sink sits in front of a large window to light up the sink space and to flood the kitchen with natural light. The remaining space on the living floor accommodates two bedrooms and a common bathroom. The bedrooms are spacious and are fitted with good-sized windows, which not only offers better ventilation, but also increases the perceived space in the bedrooms. A custom wooden staircase with a metal railing leads to the master suite on the third story. The landing is enlarged to create a reading nook overlooking the living room or a spot to fly paper airplanes off. The upper floor accommodates the private functions of the house. There is a master bedroom with a window that lines the top of the wall, providing a tree-filled skyline view. The bedroom is serviced by a beautiful tiled modern bathroom, which features a bathtub, a walk-in shower, a toilet, and modern sink. The most notable feature about this extraordinary house is the intense use of color in almost every space both on the movable and fixed furniture, including walls and bathroom tiling, even on the outside tilting container. The large openings promote an excellent cross-flow ventilation effect, expelling the hot air and drawing cool air through the interior, 
and allowing the spaces inside the house to breathe naturally. The strategic placement of windows throughout the home allows light to flood into the otherwise dark container spaces. Spaces retain the original container plywood flows throughout to celebrate the rough patches of the entire process. The exterior of the house is very ambitious. From the entrance, the most notable element is the entrance in the tilted container painted with a colorful mural with a staircase dropping out of the bottom. With its large windows, balconies, and magnificent harmonious colors, everything has been an integrity, making the entire building to read as a whole. The container doors facing the street have their infill space fitted with full height sliding glass doors and retaining the original container cargo doors as hurricane shutters just in case another hurricane decides to visit. This container home has a uniform finish of cotton steel on the exterior which exposes the rustic brutal appearance of the shipping containers at the same time helping to tone down the size of the construction and blend the structure into the streetscape. Which part of this amazing container design appeals to you the most? Kindly give us your opinion by posting in the comment section below. If you like this video as usual, give it a thumbs up and feel free to share it. If this is the first video you are watching from our channel, you are encouraged to subscribe to these and more amazing weekly videos on shipping container living. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.